money I ain't involved. No. Tell them don't waste my time. Waste man waffling down my phone. Sure. Tell them don't waste my time. No, no, no. Tell them don't waste my time. Tell them. Then I double up conscious. I know you can't meditate. If you afraid, then you come on with me. And I know what you came here to do. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a K1 bout over three two minute rounds. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the red corner from Oslo Fight Club. Put your hands together for Mikkel Bakken. And his opponent standing across the cage in the blue corner from Assassins. Give it up for Luke Worrell. This is a K1 contest over three two minute rounds. Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. Dan Moverheady. So here we go, K1 action. Michael back in, in the red corner versus Luke Worrell in the blue. Luke in the combat, shorts dips low. Big knee from Mikel. Mikel back in, known for his power kicks. Luke Worrell, a journeyman of sort, will take any fight. As he covers up here, eating some very damaging punches and a knee there to the midsection. Needs to get himself out of there, try and get himself off the cage. Let's get behind these guys, ladies and gents. Roll on the back foot. Just think about planting his feet and turning that right hand over the top as Backen comes in. Can't let Backen just shoot off when he wants to. Big kick there. Oh, nice inside low kick. Needs to be careful as he leans back there, though. If that kick had been a bit higher, he could have found himself in trouble. Or all covering up. Needs to be careful doing turning away from his opponent because he's not going to see what's coming. Worrell needs to get in, land, and move out. Just like that. Clipping right hook. Back and smiling. Acknowledging the power there from Worrell. Still in this fight. Looking for a way in. Back and using that southpaw advantage. Looking for the heavy left hand. Worrell moving, but eats a big uppercut there, swinging at the bell. Very exciting first round. Worrell though needs to keep his head up more. Very dangerous position to be in against a fighter like Mikel. Mikel known for his power. Worrell, a very game fighter. Very impressed with him, able to stay on the outside. Two of three. Mikhail Backen versus Luke Worrell. Worrell firing, firing, firing. 
Exactly what Roll needs to do. He needs to get in there, do the damage, circle out of danger. Because we know Bakken is very, very tight in that clinch position. He's able to fire off knees to the midsection of Worrell. So Worrell doesn't want to let him close that distance. Pouring out that lead, right jab is Bakken. Looking for the knee. Good work by Worrell. Big hooks over the top. Again, Worrell firing away. Back and smiling there in admiration, but Worrell is doing damage on the outside. Worrell needs to get out of this position, try and circle off the cage. Keep his head up and his guard tight. Back and looking for that big shot. Big knee to the midriff. Worrell does well, rides it. Worrell. Breathing deep. Yeah, noticeably tired. It's about the same thing there. Nice kick there from Worrell, mixing it up. Just to keep his back off this cage to circle out. Back and breathing heavily as well. You can see he's sucking in the air through that gum shield. Back in here, look, you see the way he's tentative there. He's tasted Worrell's power. He's Good being shot. careful. Nice body shot. Good work by Back in there, just changing levels. He hit the body, went to the head. Again, that knee. Both fighters looking exhausted at the end of that round. Both have given it their all. Back and just trying to find a way in. That could be quite draining in itself. He's just trying to change what he's doing. He's looking for a way in. And Worrell, obviously, showing how, showing how he's got power in these hooks. You see here from the replay, there's big power hooks coming in, and he's starting to utilize those angles, yes, he back and smile. That usually means that you've hurt a fire. Third and final round. Touch of gloves, show of good sportsmanship here in contenders. Big looping overhand right, followed up with a nice head kick. Beautiful combinations here by Worrell. He needs to do more of that, but be more clean as he gets out. He's getting a bit savvy now on the outside. Nice bit of footwork from Worrell. Starting to land, good success. Mikel trying to throw those big bombs from range. He's looking to place that power rear hand. Worrell though with good head movement, avoiding that big shot. See if Worrell can keep this pace up. He's do more of the same. Nice inside leg kick from Worrell. Firing back his leg. Backwards looking for the overhand right again. He's to start trying to mask it with combinations and other techniques. Otherwise Backen's going to see that coming. Whoa! Massive power thrown there by Backen, but misses its mark. And that's kind of the tail of the tape for Backen. Big, huge shots, but not quite finding a a home for him. Worrell having more success. Dirty boxing. Worrell now coming up with the spinning techniques. Just This shows that his confidence has grown as the rounds have gone on, Rob. He's really been able to put his feet down and implement his own game plan. Big body kick attempt there by Bakken. Question mark kick. Bakken looking for that. Heavy rear hand. Oh! And a big overhand right there from Worrell knocks the mouthpiece out of Bakken. Bakken breathing very heavily. Yeah, it seems to be, I don't know whether it's those punches or indeed the cardio of Bakken that's making him more tired in this last round. But Worrell has done a great job Closing that distance and really making back and respect his power. Very, very good fight over three rounds. The tables turned as the fight went on. Be interesting to see how the judges score it and who walks away with their hand raised. Take a look at the replay here. 
You see Worrell on the back foot. He's looking for a way, a nice Superman attempt there from back and Worrell able to keep his guard up, circle out and look for that overhand right placement. Big knee there by Bakken, but just hit the arms of Worrell. Didn't actually find his mark in the, the chest area or the abdomen. Ladies and gents, give it up for both these guys in the cage. What a hard fourth battle that was. After three hard fought rounds, ladies and gentlemen, we have a split draw. Both of these guys gonna have to get it on again. Let's have a massive round of applause for both of them in the cage. What well on, gents.